Moro Bay United were coming off a one-all draw with competition leaders Lay City FC last weekend and looked to be a tough opponent for second-placed Hekari United. But Hekari United named a strong team with the return of Raymond Gunemba a huge plus for the team. Hekari starting things off early with Gunemba trying his luck. To Gunemba. But Moro Bay United were also gunning for an early goal. On his missed it. But Gunemba had other plans. Moving forward, Gunemba. Morobe United were determined to score first, but good goalkeeping kept them at bay. While it was missed by Ishmael. Morobe United seemed to find some progress in their game plan, still were off target. But Hekari managed to score first through a nifty corner by Raymond Gunemba. Curls. There it is! But Hekari couldn't continue with more goals. Even Morobe United found it difficult. Let's set one go. Guaf. Junior Guaf. Nigel and Raymond tried their luck. Gunemba still with it. Hekari taking the one nil lead into half time. Things looked to move smoothly for Hekari in the second half. But poor execution up front was a concern. Good cross. Kepo to Dabin Yaba. Hekari seemed to have control over the situation, but experienced David Muta had a slip up, almost costing them a goal. David Muta, danger. But Hekari's luck did turn when Dabin Yaba was given a penalty. Lays it up for Dabin Yaba. Dabin Yaba down. Dabinyaba making sure to put one more goal on the scoreboard. Already. Nigel Dabinyaba for Hikari. But Dabinyaba couldn't follow through. Side. Finally, Raymond Gunemba setting one for Joseph Joe. One side for Hikari United. Lays up Joseph Joe and there it is. Morabe United had a golden opportunity but Hikari stood their ground. Chance now. Donny Giam against Ishmael Pollard. They're going to pull one back. They don't. But Morobe managed to pull one through in extra time, ending the match three goals to one. For the price of one, so to speak. And this time they pull one back. That consolation. In total, there was 31 shots at goal, with Hekari United having 19 opportunities at goal. And despite their 3-1 loss, Morabe United had 12 shots at goal.